Uh, there's a little bit of a different flavor, there's a little bit of a different style. So, so what you're going to see is if, if someone gets taken down, they're not trying to get away. They're just trying to not get turned and not get exposed to their back, you know, because after 15 to 20 seconds, they're going to be brought back up to their feet. So it's it's definitely a little bit different flavor than, than folk style wrestling, uh, what our collegiate fan is mostly used to. But in, in the sport of collegiate women's wrestling, we're in freestyle. So here we are. We're starting at 191 pounds tonight and and we have JC Fowler and, and Sandra Guerrero from New Jersey City University. So Sandra Guerrero, she's coached by Barry Hart, Walid Elakashara, and Ron Baines. And she has been a tremendous athlete who continues to grow and shine. She is now a three-time National Collegiate Women's Wrestling Championship All-American, and she won the Region 1 Championship. Lion Conley of Maryland and your man chairman, Chris Cole of Idaho. And Sally, not only do we have an individual match going on, we also have a team race going on. So every one of these matches count towards that, that team championship tonight for the University of Iowa. That's right. The University of Iowa, they came out heavy hard um, here in this. Uh, uh, Points-wise, many people thought, hey, you didn't have a shot of contention for winning this national championship team title. Um, they're starting to really show up. They are performing under pressure, and you're seeing it right now as we're watching our athletes. So right now, both athletes, they're jockeying for position. You have an underhook. And there she goes. She gets two points for that takedown. Yeah, just just stayed in good position, forced her under hook, and and, and forced Guerrero to try try a throw. And there she has a leg race. It's a quick way to score a lot of points in the sport of freestyle wrestling, and she's now up six zero. And when you're talking about women's wrestling, it's freestyle, it is action-packed. Once you get your takedown as an athlete, strategically, you're thinking, how do I capitalize on this? How do I create action on the net? She just got taken down, four points right to her back. And you can tell that she's in a dangerous yeah. position right now. There's she has her on her back. Scenario. Definitely a big, big point for Guerrero. And Guerrero, right now, she can just start to settle in, start to get her chest back, um, really putting some pressure on JC. There's a lot of time there, a, lot, a minute and a half left in this period for JC to fight off her back. Guerrero's just settling in. And, uh, and you can tell that as Guerrero is trying to roll out, it looks like she gets a little bit, she gets her back put even more in danger. Here in freestyle, it is an instantaneous. Once both shoulder blades touch the mat, that is a pin, and that's different than men's folk style. Men's folk style, it's a three-second count. That is not the case here. And you can tell it's getting awfully it's close. close. The shoulders Guerrero are up. smiling, looking at that ref, wondering how much more does she, she have to get she's put close. down. She knows she's close. JC is doing her best to fight, but... That's a fall for Sandra Guerrero. And a national championship for New Jersey City University. That's big. That's a big point. That's a big move. And, and Terry, I'm sitting here. You've won a national championship. What did it feel like? And what do you like that athlete is doing right now? Well, she's, she's relieved. She's excited. You know she's put in a lot of work to get to this point. And there's no better feeling than the, the, having that thrill of victory. Here she is just settling in. Sandy knows she's in a great position. She has a lot of time just holding her on her back. Just waiting for the call. I don't, I don't know the fact, Sally, but I'm guessing that that's the first national championship in history for New Jersey City University. You know, what's been impressive is that our programs continue to grow and we have athletes that are coming out of the woodwork um, and from this is across all programs we have over 58 now and you just got your first one from New Jersey City University tonight for this national championship championship at 101 pounds from the University